Good day, everyone. My name is Eugene. I'm uh, reaching you here today from our design shop at uh, ammoback.com. Um, we're looking today at a couple of different products that have been very, very popular over the last couple of years. Uh, this is the Squad Box 10. This particular uh, variation is in 499.10. Uh, this is the Squad Box 10. And what that means is it is a dispensing, carrying, and storage unit for 10 standard magazines, usually Staneg or Generation 3, 30 round capacity. So this box can actually hold 300 rounds, ready to go, clean, completely good. Take off the dust cover and we can see the magazine sitting here, uh, nine from here back and the 10th ready to dispense. Now for purposes of today, what we wanted to do is we wanted to um, kind of address a concern that we've been getting from some of our customers over the last little while, and that is specifically how to load um, and you know manage the actual squad box itself. So I'm gonna show you this on uh, a standard black, and this one here has been optimized. This is a magnetized version. We'll, we'll get more into this another day, um, but this particular version is, is the same squad box 10 it's just got 10 rare earth magnets here so that it can be applied to an armored personnel carrier um, or a police cruiser or whatever the client needs. Simply attach it to the vehicle and it's ready to go. So to get going here, take the dust cover off. Now I'm a right-handed person, so I'm gonna be holding a gun with my right hand. So I'm gonna show you how this works as far as dispensing with the left. All you do is you simply pull up and out. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Now, one of the things that we like to do uh, here at the shop is we always like to indicate the last magazine. So we've just simply put some duct tape on here, a truly Canadian uh, solution to almost any problem. So there's 10. Now, the thing that we want to make sure that you understand here is this. Um, the design of this particular product has been years in the making. There are a lot of different variables that have been taken into account. Everything has been tested out. Tolerances are great. Everything is ready to go. It's been well tested. Everybody loves it. Now, in order to reload this, um, the thing that we want to make sure that you understand is that um, in order for this thing to work properly, what we're focusing on is your experience as a shooter as you're reloading your, your rifle. So in order to reload this, we only thing we, uh, the only thing we caution you to do is to make sure that the curve and the ammunition on each magazine is the same way. So it's uniform as you're retrieving magazines from the dispenser, they're always oriented the same way. It's very predictable, easy to reload the gun. So for now, I'm gonna have the, the, the ammunition pointing away from me. So all you do is you just simply pull back the constant force plate with your two fingers, insert the magazine, push it down and back and restrain it with one or two fingers as needed. Number two. Now, once all 10 are in, it's a good idea to just give it a good whack and out we go. Well, the squad box itself, it can be set up and used by individuals or it can be used as part of a squad or a small group tactical engagement. That's why it's called squad box. Uh, but the idea here is that you've got 10 ready to use magazines that are not part of your own personal carry kit. So it's a dramatic increase in firepower that's available to anybody. Um, so there's the 10. Let's just show this to you one more time just so that we're all on, all on the same page. Number one. loaded ready to go we always recommend that you put the dust cover back on to keep the ammunition covered safe and clean um, so there it is squad box 10 uh, reload dispensing um, if you like what you see um, certainly leave us a like if you have any questions or any comments that you like to make leave it in the area below and uh, please consider subscribing to the channel get the word out to people that are uh, well worth checking these things out